Hey guys, it's John. So back to another video. Another thing I want to say is Happy Thanksgiving. So this, so I'm gonna be making another a little talking video. And there's my face. You haven't seen my face in a while. This video I'm gonna sh show off my Philips FWP900. So you can see them. You can't really see the model number. So I'm on Thanksgiving vacation, so I'm just going to show this off a little bit. See, of course, it's a Philips 3CD changer, your cassette deck, dual cassette. By the way, this cassette right here, this cassette door does not, it will, it will not latch. Like, see, this one will close. See, this one doesn't close, so that's why I have tape on it. And I also, and I, and here's the jog dial. All your controls on here. C turn tape AOX. Also has Dolby Surround Pro Logic. And and I'm here. I'm gonna turn it on. As you can see, it's on C mode right now. I have two discs put in here. And there's that awesome equalizer. I'm gonna turn it down. I want. I'll let you hear what it sounds like. That's pretty good. I have a Michael Jackson CD in there. See, the equalizer is the coolest thing on the stereo system. My phone's actually showing it in different color. When you see it in person, it looks a lot better. So, yeah, that. That's pretty cool. Here's the jog dial for the EQs. Optimal. Classic. Techno. Vocal. Rock. Jazz. I also have personal settings in here. And here's the base. Another thing on this thing is like you can also dim it too. See if I press dim once, see it dims the um equalizer out and it still shows the Display dim tilt will dim it, will lower the brightness a bit, and and equalize and the equalizer comes back on. Dim three, the equalizer is off, and like everything on the system is off, and the display is on. So yeah, it's pretty awesome. Another thing, here, punch. That's pretty cool. See, since I'm in North Jackson, so you can't really pick up any radio stations unless you have something hooked up to it. Because I'm like, I'm at home. This thing will pick up. This thing will pick up the signal without even hooking up an antenna. Depends on the station. See, this is this. See, this the signal here isn't that very isn't very good. I don't think it'll pick up any radio stations. It will at home, but it doesn't here. I guess it doesn't, unless I have something hooked into it. And yeah, I also have tape. See, they do work. I don't use the tape deck. CDR, DVD, and AOX. There's the AOX cord I brought with me. I'm going to show you the 
but it does change it. Alright guys, I'm back. Sorry, I'm uh, sorry about that. My memory went out. So yeah. And that's the coolest part. It has the 3C changer light. Like, if they see if you if you see not all the lights on like like the lights on this thing, like the lights will go out if there's no disc in there. That tells you that there's no no disc. So yeah, but it, so like dim mode is dim dim off is probably the best. They can see the cool equalizer. Yeah, it's pretty cool. I really I like this stereo a lot. This is an awesome stereo. A lot of the, a lot of people say these things are the worst, but these things are awesome. These things are this thing is a 2001 Philips C. Also has the also have the time set up. In case you want to know how to set the time, the timer, there's a clock and timer. See, like, if you, if you plug it in, the, um, it will just show four lines and two dots. So to set the timer on this, like, and then you just want to hit either C, turn the tape. I don't know why AOX doesn't work. Here, I'm going to put CD, and I don't know what time it is right now. Add some more. Check the time. 9:24. So I'm gonna see that. See that's how it works. It'll just start. See, you can't turn it off on here. Maybe you can. Nope. So you have to do it with the remote, or just unplug it. Then the brightness comes back on if you do it. I guess you gotta set it there and just cancel it out. See, here's the here's the remote. So yeah, another thing this thing has a hassle. See, if you hold the if you hold the stop button for five for five seconds or more, it'll go into demo mode. You can also turn it off too. That's that's pretty so that's pretty cool. Also has standby mode. So, yeah, that's pretty. Uh, that's awesome. And I also have. See, that's here. That's here for my computer. See, here's the cord. And there's the. Damn it! Can't get it. There we go. There's the ports for the speakers. This thing is Adobe Pro Logic, so it can hold up to six speakers. It came with all speakers when I bought it. It came with the surround, came with the surround in the center, and the subwoofer, and all that. All that shit. Not saying it's bad, but it's pretty awesome. There's the power cord. There's the AC thing. You probably can't see it, but... By the way, I had two stereos like this before, and I wasn't... I was kind of an idiot with those, didn't treat them white, but this one is working fine, so I don't mess with it. Thank you guys for watching. And we'll see you on the next video.